Hi there. Great leaders and great managers seek a level of control um, over almost everything in their operation to a certain extent. Now obviously we don't all have the time, the energy, and the focus to be able to control everything. However, there are those certain things that we have more control over than we think we do. One of those happens to be energy and the energy of our team. Remember that your team is always looking for you in regards to how they should be reacting. And they will feed off of your energy if you're conveying energy. You don't have to look very far. You think about the last interaction you had with somebody that was all down and humdrum and everything, and you kind of lowered your energy level to match them. Whereas if you have that particularly hyper individual all the time, you'll naturally raise it. Your team operates in the same way. And so what you need to look to do as a leader is see what you can do to change simple interactions you have with people to something that's a little bit more energetic. You can change your verbiage, manage your verbiage for energy, your tone. You can raise it, lower it, start talking louder, more excitedly, quicker, that sort of thing. Body language leaning into somebody, maintaining that eye contact, maintaining that intensity, those are all energy producing things in those other people. And that's the sort of thing that increases the productivity. That's where your return on investment of energy is in the operation. So if you want people to be passionate about things, you have to convey that passion. And one of the best ways to do that is through energy. Now, it isn't just what you do and what you convey, you can also call things out in people as well. So catch people doing something right. People love it when they're doing the right thing and when they get that recognition, it gives them a little bolt of, of positive enthusiasm. You know, encourage people to run outside, get some fresh air, encourage curiosity. If they've got a question about something, then really feed it if it's something that's, that's you know, wor worthwhile to the operation. You know, mix things up, change desks around, have some fun, but really focus on energy occasionally. You know, it doesn't necessarily need to be something that's constantly talked about, you, but you also don't want a constant grind of work. You want to mix things up. You want to have a way that you can lift everybody's spirits, lift everybody's mood, and when they are working more energetically, they're going to be working more productively. Thanks. Have a good one.